Hi everyone, welcome back to another Curious Curly video. Today we're going to do a special video, it's going to be a little different, a book review. I have recently gotten a copy of Happiness, Freedom, and the Open Road, Live and Travel in an RV, Van, or Car for less than $25 a day. It is written by my good friend Laura Howe. She is now an author. This is her first book. She has a website that she just started up last year um, called Travel Cheap Like a Pro. I'm part of her newsletter and I saw that she was writing a book and I was super excited. Uh, and so I just had to pick up a copy and I told her I'm going to do a video review because Amazon won't let me do an actual review. Anyways, so I wanted to tell you guys a little bit about her book and where to find it. It's going to be uh, down in the description below is the link to Amazon to purchase it in a paperback or you can get it through Kindle Unlimited, which is like a $10 subscription and you get her book for free as well as tons of other books. So. Her book is a guide to traveling on the road, but she also has a lot of experience backpacking the world. And she first did her, she talks about this in her book, she did her first traveling experiences doing a year abroad as an exchange student in England and decided to continue her journeys after that. I think she went to Australia and some other cool places when she was a young adult. And then um, after she had breast cancer, she decided to go traveling again in an RV and then um, I didn't know this either, but she was a travel agent for eight years and um, I tried doing the travel agency thing last year before the pandemic and it didn't really work out, but it's super cool that she was able to do it for eight years and um, she obviously the travel bug bit her pretty hard. So then after her experience with breast cancer, she um, went on the road and has kind of been doing it for off and on for the years since then. She became an attorney because she needed to have a well-paying job and uh, was super successful with that. And even in a nomadic way, none of her clients knew that she was an attorney on the road. She only took jobs that allowed her to stay on the road and not have to show up in court very often. And she even hired out another lawyer to go stand in court for her. So super cool and super interesting her story and how she has gotten to the place she is now. So if you are looking for a guide that has a bunch of um, personal anecdotes of how she actually did it as well as the beginner know-how. The very second chapter, the second chapter in here is called Terms and Definitions and she goes through a lot of travel slang and um, you know kind of camping slang that nobody really realizes is slang. So I didn't even know that like the definition of a slide out. I know that's part of a camper but even when I was taking Britain through the RV park uh, a few weeks ago, he didn't know what that meant. Uh, he, I was like, oh, it's got a slide out. And he was like, oh, this, that's what you're talking about. I'm like, yeah, doesn't everybody know? But she does a really awesome job about cutting through all that and just telling you what it is so that when she brings it up later, um, you know, you know what a black water tank is. And at the end, there is a resource guide. So if you get the digital version, those are active links you can click. Um, in this paperback copy, you would have to type it into your computer, but um, yeah, there's some cool things in here and even a, an arrival and departure checklist for an RV. She's got um, some cute photos of her traveling as well as some pictures of her van conversions. Uh, that's the video I have of her is in her first cargo van, um, Chevy Express, and then she when she came back from backpacking the world, um, she moved into a smaller van. It's a Ford Transit Connect. So if you're looking for a really awesome guide to traveling on the road, I go pick up her book. And I wanted to leave you with a few passages from the book. Um, 
I I wanted to get a paper copy because um, there's not too many times when you see your name in print. <laughs> I was in a newspaper because of some random um, reporter on the street and so I made sure to get a copy of that newspaper and that's why I got a copy of this book. There's a passage that she mentions me in and I wanted to read it to you. Let's go to page... Here we go. So it's on page 58 in the paperback. There are lots of videos on YouTube of beautifully decked out vans with showers, fancy cabinetry, and all the comforts of a traditional home. I chose a simple conversion. You should convert your van how you want. It is important to have enough space to sleep and do daily tasks. My friend Carly did a video of my old van in 2018 for her YouTube channel, Curious Carly. The video is titled Van Life Tour 2016 Chevy Express Cargo Van, Solo Female Travel. If you wanna check it out, she has a lot of great videos on her channel. So I thought that was cute. But I also wanted to read the back of the book because it gives a good overview of what you'll find. Laura caught the travel bug when she was an exchange student in England in her 20s. She hasn't stopped traveling since then. She lived and traveled in an RV and two cargo vans. In 2018 and 2019, she traveled the world for nine months living out of a carry-on sized backpack. Her passion is showing people how to travel cheap like a pro. After recovering from breast cancer treatment and the shock of her diagnosis, Laura hit the road full time in an RV because she realized how short life could be. Do you want to love and go where you've always wanted to go now before it's too late? Tomorrow is not guaranteed. Most authors of books on nomad life write about how great the lifestyle is with Instagram worthy pictures thrown in without taking into consideration the negative aspects of the lifestyle. This is not one of those books. Laura loves nomad life, but she had many mishaps along the way. She has stories to share and lessons to pass on. Open this book to embark on a life filled with happiness, freedom, adventure, and new experiences. Your new life is waiting for you. So if that interests you, I definitely think you should go get the book. Of course, I give her five out of five stars and uh, we will be seeing more of Laura in the future. <laughs> if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Leave a comment below. If you go get her book, let me know. I'd love to know how many people go check out her book and um, check out her website, travelcheaplikeapro.com. I'm gonna put all the links down below so it's super easy for you to find her. And yeah, I, I will be having Laura on and stay tuned for that video. I'm super excited to bring it to you. Um, Laura has so much energy and I'm so excited to share it with you. If you haven't seen her YouTube channel, she does quick little videos on places that she's been and tips on how to get there or what to do when you're there. I think she went to the place that you two um, took pictures for their album, Joshua Tree. She went to, um, it's called The Slab, I think, outside of Death Valley, a good free campsite. So things like that if you want to know more. Again, thank you so much for watching this video and I'll catch you in the next one. Be sure to stay curious. Bye! Check out this video right here if you haven't already of Laura and her cargo van. It's not her current van, but it's still a really good video about how to do a pretty cheap conversion.